Good evening, everybody, and on behalf of Father Tim Mazur, our pastor, our deacons, our staff, and everybody here at St. John Vianney, my name is John Laginus, and again, I have the happy responsibility tonight of welcoming you back here to the sanctuary here at St. John Vianney, and in front of this beautiful reminder of this prayer that we have taken to praying every Monday evening, our rosary for our pastor, Father Tim, and his journey through cancer treatment, all those who are in treatment for cancer or any other kind of illness, for the situation regarding our pandemic, and of course, any intentions that you have on your heart tonight. One of the things that I appreciate the most about Father Tim is his steady courage and his trust in the Lord when things are challenging. And I was reminded of that this weekend. I was on a bit of a vacation, and I was kayaking through a river. And in the middle of this very large river was this very large rock. And the rock reminded me of that stable place that even when things are moving and uncertain certain around us, the Lord is our rock, and especially in times of suffering or sorrow. So as we pray these sorrowful mysteries tonight, I thought we would focus on the ways that God is a rock of strength for us in challenging times and even in the hopeful times and how we can rely on the Lord. So that'll be kind of our meditation for this evening. And again, lifting up all of our intentions, let us begin. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell, and on the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From there he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The first sorrowful mystery is the agony in the garden. One of the most telling images of this biblical scene is we see Christ kind of kneeling at the feet of a tree alone. And though he did have people with him in so many ways, he was very much alone that night. One of the ways that the Lord is a rock for us in challenging times is his presence with us when we feel most alone. I'm sure a lot of us have experienced emotional or even physical isolation in many ways. In fact, again, this, these last few months have been filled with that for many of us in different ways. One of the things that the Lord does the most for me when I'm suffering is no, there's no magic reset button where he just takes all the bad stuff away. Even better, he reminds me of how near he is in so many palpable ways. Sometimes it's just the people around me, my friends, my family who remind me of his love for me. Sometimes it's just that interior strength that I know is him and not my own. So grateful for the countless ways that the Lord reminds us that we are not alone is a rock for us when we are suffering, we pray. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. 
Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, and save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls into heaven, especially those in the most need of thy mercy. The second sorrowful mystery is the scourging at the pillar. What had to be going through Jesus' mind at that moment? Obviously, the intensity of the suffering of that moment, for sure. But one of the things that I imagine has to be on Christ's mind is the deeper meaning of everything that he was suffering. He knew that this momentary and, albeit super intense, pain was leading to a victory down the road. One of the ways that God is a rock for us in times of suffering is helping us to remember the deeper meaning, not just of our suffering, but of our lives. That getting by minute by minute with as least pain as possible isn't the purpose. Uh, just kind of filling our lives with as many good things as we can, can grab onto isn't the purpose. There is no greater love than this than to lay down one's life for a friend. That's our purpose. That's what we were made for. In our hardwiring, that's what we have. So grateful for a God who reminds us of our deeper purpose, even when we're suffering, we pray. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls into heaven, especially those in the most need of thy mercy. The third sorrowful mystery is the crowning with thorns. That crown is an odd symbol, obviously given to Jesus for in order to mock him. But when Jesus wears that crown, it really is a sign of hope. Kind of piggybacking off the theme we just meditated on, the crown is really our victory, right? The crown shows us that this suffering, though it is a mantle we wear for now, is a challenge that leads to our deeper becoming. The crown reminds us that we are made for glory. And though it's hard to see sometimes when times are tough, we see in Jesus the strength to bear what was supposed to be a mocking crown and wear it with the dignity of glory. So grateful for a God who's a rock for us, always reminding us of the glory to come, we pray. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass against us, lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, and save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls into heaven, especially those in the most need of thy mercy. The fourth sorrowful mystery, the carrying of the cross. Each step that Christ took in the way of the cross had to be filled with a profound amount of uncertainty. Even as he knows where he's headed, even as he knows, obviously, what is to come, it had to feel like he didn't know whether he could make the next step or not, whether he was going to make it to the cross or not, whether he had the strength to endure or not. I think for a lot of us, the challenge of the last few months has been the profound uncertainty. And I'm sure as Father Tim and other cancer patients and other people have gone through long journeys that require a lot of inner strength, they, can, they would probably tell us long before there was a pandemic that step by step by step journey is so crucial and so much uncertainty really rests on our ability to take one step at a time to let the lord guide each individual step knowing that the lord will provide everything we need under each foot and it's easy to get ahead of ourselves and worry about well, what about the step after that and the step after that? And the Lord just keeps reminding us, you know, take that step. And I've got everything you need on that step. And then take another step. And even though you may think you're going to collapse or you can't handle it, I've got everything that you need. Just rely on me one step at a time. So grateful for God who's a rock for us by reminding us to take one step at a time and that he'll always give us what we need. We pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. 
O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls into heaven, especially those in the most need of thy mercy. The fifth sorrowful mystery is the crucifixion. The way that God is a rock for us, the most, I think, is by not doing what sometimes we really want him to do, which is take it all away. All right? It would just be so much easier. Can you please just press the button? But the Lord, instead of taking it all away, led us himself down the path of redemption. And redemption is different than reset. Redemption means we become who we were made to become. So instead of just pressing reset and starting it all over, he takes who we are and instead of resetting us, he makes us more. The gift of redemption is the way that God is the rock in the storm for us the most. The rock on that moving river of life that seems so uncertain. It's because we know that no matter where the water takes us, if we let the Lord be our guide, it is taking us to a fuller version of ourselves. And so we really don't even have to worry, though of course we do. We don't have to worry. We don't have to bear the burdens of all the uncertainties of this time in our life. All we have to do is let the Lord steer the boat. And that we know that not only will we get through it, but we'll be a better version of ourselves, the best version of ourselves. And we'll be one with him. So grateful for a God who leads us where we need to go, we pray. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins and save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls into heaven, especially those in the most need of thy mercy. And as we conclude our rosary tonight and our closing prayers, often we take time to invoke another intercession at this point or think about somebody who needs our prayers tonight. And tonight as we think about God our rock, I think about the rocks that the Lord has placed in our lives. Of course, the family and friends and the other people in our lives that are 
that mo those people who bring us strength and understanding and comfort in times of trouble. But I also think about the communion of saints tonight. We stand in a, as the scriptures reminded us, a cloud of witnesses that even those who share union with God forever are not disconnected from us. In many ways, they're closer to us now than they were when they were here on earth. And so we have not only the people around us to encourage us, but a whole cloud of witnesses cheering us on, praying for us, and encouraging us. So grateful for the gift of them, we conclude our prayers tonight. Hail Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, thine eyes of mercy toward us. And after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. St. Michael the Archangel, defend us in this day of battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the Heavenly Hosts, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who prowl through the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Thank you again for joining us for our rosary tonight. We will be back next Monday night for another chance to pray together and to connect spiritually. Know that I and all of us here are praying for you through this week that we would be constantly reminded of God's strength and courage and assistance, the way that God is a rock for us this week. And may the Lord bless us, protect us from all evil, and bring us all to everlasting life. Amen. Thank you for joining us.